All right, folks, well, we are out on a very rainy day in the van. I've got my two buddies, Scott and Matt. They're out uh, with me here. Very rainy weekend. Thought I'd just bring you guys along and uh, we'll just do a short video kind of showing you guys a little bit of a rainy day camp life. All right, so of course the staple on a rainy morning is coffee. This morning we're doing the van living, but uh, yeah, it's just really coming down out here. Gotta have a little creamer. Can't do the straight black coffee. Good. Yeah, cross the top. So uh, Daisy is back with Megan back in town, um, no. staying nice and dry. But Scott brought out his lab, and he just thinks it's the greatest thing. So Matt, for a stick for him one time. You want a stick thrown, buddy? You're, yeah. oh, you're too close, too close. There you go. I know. You want the stick. Best you want the stick. Best friends. Like, hey, remember that time when you threw the stick for me? It was so cool. So much fun. I just can't hardly like, control myself. Oh, you want to throw that stick? Here, throw the stick. Where's it at? Oh, yeah. Ready? Go get it. Yeah. All day. It's all day. It's all day, isn't it? All day. So this morning we're just gonna cook up some bacon. Um, I didn't feel like eggs this morning, so we're gonna do something a little different. I've got some chicken hearts in here, so we're gonna fry up some bacon and chicken hearts for breakfast. So I uh, put my chair underneath the van. I had slid it underneath, but apparently I didn't get it uh, far enough under. As you can see, it is uh, full of water. So uh, what are you cooking for breakfast there, Scott? Um, it's it's a quite a gourmet meal. It's uh, a day-old sausage McMuffin with egg. We're just warming her up. So if you guys are wondering why I'm the only one eating, that's what happens when you film cooking. They didn't film cooking, so they are already done eating. I had to film cooking, so I just now get to eat. It's almost lunchtime. It's almost <laughs> lunch. It's almost lunch. <laughs> so camping in the rain, you know, a lot of times I don't people don't like it, but uh, you know, when you got a good setup, like the three of us do have pretty good setups and uh, you can stay dry and comfortable and warm. Uh, I think camping in the rain is really nice and uh, you know it could be a really it's a really great time to just chill and relax tell stories and just uh, you know take a minute to get away from you know everyday life and all the you know horse stuff that's going on in the world and yeah I think it's uh, it's just a great time to be out especially when you got good friends like I do out here like these two guys are probably the two best friends I have in the world and uh, yeah, it's a great time.
right, well, we're getting a little bit of a reprieve from the rain. Uh, we've just been kind of hanging out by the gas fire pit, enjoying some uh, podcasts and chatting. You know, it's actually, like I said, it's been a very relaxing and enjoyable time. The weather forecast did say that we'd get a little reprieve in the rain, and uh, we are getting it here around noonish, but uh, we are supposed to get a bunch more, so. Very hopeful of that because, man, I tell you what, this has been a rough summer, lots of fires, and uh, to look about the forest, you can see that uh, it's been very hard on the on the trees and everything. Everything's got is brown and looks like it's dying. And I'm really, really hoping that uh, that uh, things are going to start coming back around as the rains start back up this fall.